I will now show you how to trim your rabbit's toenails. The toenail trimmers that I prefer to use are small cat toenail trimmers. When I have someone to help me, which is always helpful, one person can hold the rabbit while the other person trims the toenails. But the person that is holding the rabbit takes the rabbit's scruff and puts their thumb over the ears. Then they scoop up the rabbit's rump, having most of the weight on the bottom hand, and place the rabbit with its rump on the table. Next, the person that is trimming the toenails takes one of the front paws, or whichever paw you want to start with, and then presses the middle of the paw pad, which makes the toenails kind of flare out. Next, you take you start on one side of the paw and you take one toenail and you trim a little bit off. Then you go to the next toenail. You repeat until you've trimmed all the toenails on both front feet. And don't forget the dew claws, which are located on the middle of both the front feet. Then you move on to the back feet. You take one paw and you press the middle of the pad, which makes the toenails flare out. Then you peel the fur back from the toenail and trim a little bit off. Move on to the next toenail. And repeat until you've trimmed all the toenails on both hind feet. Something that can help is if your rabbit's toenails, if you trim too much off, and they might start to bleed. We use quick stop styptic powder, which helps to prevent the rabbit from bleeding. If you were to nip your rabbit's toenails, you take a little bit of the quick stop and you put it on the toenail. But since my rabbit's toenails aren't bleeding, the styptic powder isn't sticking to the toenails.